I use strange October. <laughs> very, very weird as far as weather <laughs> very goes. Very weird. Now we are starting off November, and November is saying, hey, you know what? I know my place. I got you. I'm going to act exactly how yeah. I should. And it, and it did that immediately, uh -huh. mind you. It's it's so far, it's fall-like temperatures, and it's like, here's rain. Yeah. Here's rain. You don't even have to wait Thank in the extended. You so much. We got you. So that's what we're looking at. Some nice rainy conditions, fall like temperatures. Our average dropping now 67 and then our average low at 45. But by the end of this month, we should be down as an average in the 50s. So it's just an indicator that we are slowly approaching those cold like months. Of course, we are in November, almost there to December. Our sunrise sunset, which is interesting, is by the end of the month, our sunrise will be at 716 and our sunset at 509. We are losing daylight, but of course, we are still anticipating some good old rain. We may even end the month above average considering this is our normal for the month and we are looking at some very wet conditions. And of course, hey, look, we went ahead and added a normal snowfall. Not much, but we could, uh, it is common that we could see some a, a trace, I should say. Of course, we're not uh, seeing any of that so far, but at least we are tracking some nice and needed rainfall. So Tulsa International Airport, all part of Wade's RV Weather Camera Network. It is a quiet and chilly start this morning. Tulsa, we're sitting at 44 degrees. We are still tracking some northeasterly winds, so that's what's making it feel a lot chillier out there. As we could see a few see dropping in the upper 30s this morning, much chillier. So as you have uh, heading off to work this morning, of course, those kiddos waking up thinking, what am I going to wear if you're waiting at the bus stop? Definitely bundle up this morning. I mean, it is still looking very pleasant this afternoon. Looking at a very fall-like day, which we haven't had in quite some time. Temperatures all across the area as a high is going to be in the lower 70s, so almost just a few degrees above our average. But then things really start to change going into this weekend. So if you do have Friday night plans, those look good to go. No rain chances, no issues whatsoever there. But looking at this weekend, we are tracking mid-60s, low 70s. But key here is all of this rain we're looking at. So early morning Saturday, going to be dry. But here's about 8 o'clock. That's when we're starting to see some showers and storms moving in. And then this line of storms is going to start to move in by about 4 o'clock. And this is what... Once this moves through, we're just going to see continuous rainfall as we look through Saturday night, early Sunday as well. Here's about 5 o'clock Sunday morning, so definitely have the rain gear on hand if you're going to any football games, any outdoor events, of, of course. And then as we look in terms of severe storms, we have to watch for Monday because that's when we have the chance here in green country. Not only that, but we are talking some good amount of rainfall. Look at this, all highlighted in the purple. That's the highest amount, and that ranges all the way from Lawton, Oklahoma City, including us here in Tulsa. And that is the next seven days. So good amount of rainfall this weekend, even on into next Monday.